Hey, good day, everyone. David DeHaas of Living Water, and uh, I'm going to talk today about the perfect cleanse and what that looks like. So if you haven't been following me recently and you want to know a little bit about why I'm here and why I'm doing this, I was uh, very, very sick for a long time. Had severe allergies, had severe psoriasis, candida yeast, fungus, always tired, really didn't have the energy. Loved to play basketball, but every time I did, I'd like, I would tear something. I'd had foot orthotics made for me special because I could never get that to heal. Uh, had fungus actually growing on my feet and legs. Uh, and eventually I had uh, a cancer. And uh, by the time I got to there, I had discovered a lot of different modalities that were very helpful in the healing process. But I hadn't quite found that last missing piece of the puzzle. And eventually in 2005, I found that last missing link. And that became what was known as the 10-day deep tissue cleanse here at Living Waters. So we do a healing retreat here in, in Boise, Idaho. So if you want to know more about that, I've got a link down below. Go, you can go to our website, watch the Four Natural Laws of Healing webinar. But today it's Jan, you know, it's January, and this is the month most people are, are looking at detoxing or doing some kind of a fast or a cleanse. Or the, the cleanse is pretty a loose word I found. So let me clear up that today here on this broadcast so just hang with me for the next five or six minutes so maybe most of you are out there you've got your green juice or you've got some carrot juice you're going on the juicing and so forth and you think you're doing a great cleanse well you know it's great that you're doing that because what you're really doing though is not necessarily cleansing the body you're giving your body a break from from digestion so you're not creating a lot of uh load on the digestive tract which is great uh, and you're getting more and more nutrients to the cells, which at the end of the day, when we talk about my Four Natural Laws of Healing webinar, which you can visit in the link down below, is we want to heal the cells. But what you're not doing is really doing a truly a deep tissue cleanse. And we're going to talk about why we want to cleanse these. So if you're experiencing brain fog, if you're experiencing psoriasis, if you've got acne, if you've got bloating, if you've got brain fog, uh, if you've got constipation, Stay tuned for the next few minutes. I'm going to explain to you the quickest, easiest way that we've found to help you get on your healing journey quickly and easily. So let me share my screen right now. Not that screen, this screen. There we go. And that's to broadcast. Here we go. Make me go small. There we go. So here's what a healthy digestive... Uh, and internal parts of your body looks like here's your liver, your stomach, your duodenum, your small intestine, the large intestine, which is also called the colon. So just uh, we use those words interchangeably. All right. But the reality is, is that over time, due to stress, emotions, and so forth, your body can, can become very, very toxic. In fact, the average person packs 12 to 15 pounds of extra poop. So if you're drinking juice, like I'm drinking juice today, uh, this is not going to get the old gunk that's been in the trunk for so long. In order to do that, you've got to do a thing called colon hydrotherapy. Colon hydrotherapy is just what it sounds like. It's water being fused into the colon. It's doing two things. It's going to help dissolve old fecal matter. And more importantly, over time, your colon has got to look at something like this. This is caused by emotions and stress and fear and anger. And I was twisted, and this colon can go from being about three inches in diameter, as you see here, to as big as 16 inches. And so this down here, this on the lower left here, you see this is a, this is a big amount of old mass that's sitting in there. And for those of you who had your gallbladder out or your appendix out, the real problem wasn't that the, the, those two items got went bad. The real item was you're constipated first. And if you didn't ever do anything about the constipation, by healing the colon, the intestinal tract and clearing it out and getting it toned and back into proper shape. When I say tone, I literally mean like going to the gym tone. So when you're doing colon hydrotherapy and the water's going in, this muscle wants to push back and do what they call peristalsis. And so you don't have proper peristalsis if you're constipated. And most of you probably don't even know you're constipated. And just a definition, if you're not pooping uh, on the Bristol tool start at number three, th two to three times a day, you're probably constipated. In fact, I would bet money on it. So, and even if you've done a colonoscopy, you are probably still constipated. Doing a colonoscopy is not going to clear out the colon, although you took a bunch of stuff and you had diarrhea and you had a lot of water flush through you, you thought you were clear. The fact is, you probably were not. 
It's not unusual. I've had people come in after doing colonoscopies, do a colonic, and then they've had a lot of stuff come out. And they're always shocked and surprised. But I'm not because your colon looks something like this. And this little fecal matter can get in there, and, and much like an old lasagna pan, it really is dry and as hard as this. But in your gut, what we want to do when we do a proper cleanse, we want to clean the colon. Okay, We want to clean the small intestine. And if you've got lungs or breathing issues, in the intestinal tract, you have all these nerve connections. So if I can enlarge this. So you see here, down, if you see my mouse uh, circling here, this is the pleural cavity. And this is where the lungs, that around, this goes around the lungs. So if you got lung issues on your left or right side, that's where this is at, you probably got a lot of old debris in here. And you have more neurons in your gut than your spinal column. Think about it, that's a lot of neurons compared to your spinal column. Whoa, why is that? Well, every organ and part in your body has a nerve connection. It goes from that organ or part, whether it be your neck, shoulder, lung, kidneys, liver, uh, breasts, uh, brain. Here's the brain area up here in the transverse colon. To every organ to, goes to the colon or small intestine. So how this lives is how you're going to live, right? So the reality is, is you have the surface area the size of a tennis court, what I call shag carpet. So... This villi is what absorbs the vitamins and minerals, those micronutrients that you're taking via supplements or your greens that you're juicing. Problem is that this is all matted down like a tile floor. How much can you absorb through a tile floor? Well, not much. So let's clean up. We literally want to do a steam cleaning on the colon, right? And, and then and start sweeping out the old debris. And when you do that, the neurons start firing. Guess what else starts firing? Your brain starts firing. All these connections start firing and wiring properly, and you begin to heal. The reality is, is your gut's looking something like this, or like this, or like this. And if you've got little tiny rabbit-type poops, this is probably what you got going in your colon. Um, if you've got a prolapse, this is a prolapse of diverticuli. The only way you're going to get rid of diverticuli is this pushed out pockets of poop is to dissolve it with water. And so where colon hydrotherapy comes in, we use a very gentle infusion of water going into your colon, your specially made bed. Uh, I'll show you one here in a second. And so you're going to be lying on this bed, covered up. It's very, very private. And you are going to have water infused in your colon using a small rectal tube, smaller than a pencil. And here's what that looks like. Okay? So this is a gravity flow bed. So the water is very gentle. just trickles in. You can shut the water at any time. Can't hurt you. Won't harm you. Very easy to do. And uh, people usually get off and they say, gee, I feel lighter and refreshed. So if you want to feel lighter and refreshed, if you want to clear out the cobwebs, get rid of the brain fog, get more energy, I'm, su I'm suggesting to you that this is really the foundation where healing begins. And once you do this, you go to your your uh, other doctors, your other healthcare providers, may that be your, uh, maybe a physical therapist, maybe it's going to a naturopath, maybe it's going to a homeopath, maybe it's going to a chiropractor. Uh, those, this really complements everything they're doing. So we work with a lot of those people and they will send us people they notice, hey, you're constipated, you need to go see Living Waters because this is gonna help you. So anyway, when we do that, when we're doing all this stuff, we're going to start, we're going to clean out the kidneys. We're going to clean out the liver. We're going to do a little liver cleanse. Our 10-day cleanse, this gallbladder, if you still have yours, all these stones in here, those will be removed. If you've got a liver looking like this on the right, the only way you're going to heal that is start doing some liver cleansing. I've done 47 now, and i got to tell you, it feels so great. So we do that, then these neurons start firing, right? So... Uh, and when you get all that clean and you get the lymphatic system cleaned out, because now the lymphatic system dump its, it always dumps its stuff into the vein. And now when you clean the liver, now it has the blood's going to clean all that up. Guess what? Those fat cells, you got harboring all those toxins and you can't lose weight. Or if you do lose weight, you gain it back. Guess what? Now the body's given permission. I don't need all these fat cells. And you begin to lose weight and keep it off permanently. So that's the short tour. If you want to go to our webinar, Click the link below. Go check it out. We do a 10-day deep tissue cleanse. We do it once a month. We only take 12 people. It's a limited amount of room here. If you want to do that, you need to watch the video. In fact, we don't let anybody do a clock or anything until you've watched that webinar because we want you to be educated. 
You take the power into your own hands and the knowledge that you understand what you're doing and why you're doing it. So definitely watch that webinar. Hey, give us a like if you like what we've been sharing with you. Uh, give us a share. Share to your friends or family. Anybody's got concerns, let them take a look at the video. Then make, make a call here and just do a consult and see if this is for you or not. Um, and uh, in the meantime, I'm going to let you guys all go today. You have a blessed day. If you got any questions, post them down below in the comments section. We'll try to get back to those as soon as we can. You all have a blessed day. I'm David DeHaas from Living Waters Cleanse, where healing begins. Healing begins by healing from within. Make a blessed day.